this. I don't know. <laughs> you definitely are tuned to the right show. Get my ready name's... to unsubscribe. Yep. My name's Bobby Lee. And I'm Ditto Andrew. Tito Andrew. Tito Andrew. Tito yeah. Andrew. Brandy's... But I can call you Tito Tom. Okay. <laughs> oh, call him Tito Tom. And Tito Bert. No, uh, just Bert. That sounds Wait. weird. No, but it sounds very like, like, okay, Tito Bert. It's good to see you. You know why we do this at 4 p.m., right? Why? Because the the guy that normally sits there sleeps till 3. <laughs> so that's when you, he does the show at 4 p.m. This is amazing. We do our show at 10 a.m. I can't wait to do a podcast where you only get 200,000 subscribers. <laughs> <laughs> Who fucking made out on this deal, huh? I know. The I fucking know. bad friends are all of a sudden on a hit podcast. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And now all of a sudden we got to fucking lift them up. We got to come into this shit box and listen to this fucking dope out there. This So is this, should this be like someone's, like, would this, is this where people would shoot heroin at this building? This looks like a, this looks like a fucking storage unit. It's kind of sketchy, right? Um, I like it. Jesus. Jesus. They have beaten the fuck out of you, haven't I know. they? Do you have... Do you you, can you, you know you can us. be honest with us. You don't have to be like, it's cool here. I like Andrew and I like Bobby. You can tell us the truth. I don't like them. Thank you. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I think they, they just know that those snow bunnies are easy to get it into because you know that like among black guys... The whole thing is that white girls are whores, right? Like that's the whole thing. No. Yeah, for sure. They're like white chicks are white chicks will will suck it, we'll put it in their ass, we'll do it like white girls are whores. So are they all serious? they all just stick their dicks in them because they're like they'll just do it. Yeah. And I'm we, saying among college athletes for sure. Really? A hundred percent. Well, I guess the ones that like you see the black dudes at the mall with, like those ones that are like <laughs> fours. <laughs> Like then maybe sure, but like like Leanne, fucking good luck, <laughs> Bush. <laughs> the white chicks I hang out with are horse. But if you go on a college campus and like any big D one basketball or football program, you're a black dude. Wait, like, how is, where's this research coming from, <laughs> dude? Put it out there and and <laughs> and tell me that I'm wrong. Tell me that I'm wrong. <laughs> They're getting their dick sucked by. I want to fucking. I want to call. White. I want to call. I want yeah? to call one of my black friends. Really? Find out. Yeah. Oh, please do. Okay. It's not a comic, is it? No, 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 no. But he's got a he's got a comic sensibility. Okay. He's. Uh, I don't want to say who he is in case he says something horrific. Here we go. Yeah. All right. Let's call him and find out. Oh, I'd love. To, I want to hear this so badly. What's his right. name? Um, you can't say. Okay. I can say. I guess it's Omar. Omar Dorsey, he was in, uh, he's in Eastbound and Down. Okay. He's in the, <clears throat> uh, he's the guy who I, I had come over and read the N word in my book. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, which word? The, it's the, no, nah, never mind. He said never mind? No, <laughs> no, he said it like a white guy. <clears throat> Where is he? I love that you can't believe that someone's not answering. Where is he? Yeah. <laughs> like it's impossible. Well, I mean, it's, it's me. <laughs> yeah. The only person that doesn't answer when I call is you. You have reached the voicemail box of eight. Okay. Points. All right. So, uh, yeah, he'll call back. We'll you will? Get some, well, yeah, we'll get some some clarification on that. Oh, I know another black dude. Call the other black dude. Um. All right. What's his name? Sterling. Okay. Sterling is such a black name. Sterling. You know Sterling Sharp? Hold on. Hold on. Sterling. Shit. Oh, here's Omar. Perfect timing. Oh, great. Omar. What's going on, Bert? Hey, uh, you're on the podcast. I need to ask you I need to ask you your opinion. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm with my buddy Tom, and he was saying that that commonly known at like at like say like Florida State or like a big uh, division one school. Yeah. That that black guys' opinions of white girls is that they're they're whores and easier to fuck than black chicks. Is that true? homework <laughs> <laughs> miss giuliani how did you hook up with these guys i'm just out of curiosity um at the Kalila. oh wait are you related yeah did you just get a tattoo no wait oh uh, wait do you live with them yeah i know who the fuck you are <laughs> i know who the fuck you are 
Who the okay. fuck? Hey, who the fuck oh, is no she? Oh, no wonder. I just put the math together. I was like, she's Filipino. Yeah. Of course. You are really good at doing this, man. I'm sitting here going, Jesus, is she like a fucking kidnapped or something? I know. Like, I know. blink twice if you need to get let loose. I know. She, looked, they t- she was like, I was I was in the Philippines. They promised me some modeling work. They grabbed my passport. <laughs> Next thing you know, I'm sitting here on a third mic on a fucking mediocre podcast. Listen to some fucking ginger talk to a fucking <laughs> Korean guy. <laughs> to a guy who looks like an How... organism. Be honest. Hold on. Cheers. Cheers. To bad friends. To bad friends. How bad is it to live with Bobby? God. Oh, that's right. You live with Bobby. Yeah. Live with Bobby. Um, How gross is he? So what time? Yeah, like what What time does he get up to work out? Work out? I was joking. Like exercise. I was joking. <laughs> <laughs> and has anyone ever cleaned this mic? Just out of curiosity. No. I wouldn't imagine so. <laughs> that's That one I would be more scared of than this one. Oh. Uh, no fucking shit. My lips been touching it. I'm a little freaked out. Name Almost. a country. I'll do an accent. Oh, this is a fun game. Go ahead. Argentina. Uh, Argentina. There you go. Really good. Okay. France. Okay. Okay. France. Ready? I'll, I'll say it. Ready? France. But no, no. Hold on. I'll do a full okay. sentence. Hi, I am from Argentina. I'm so sorry my cow got into your yard. <laughs> However, let me grab my boleaderos. I will catch him, bring him back over to my house. I'll make a little bit of uh, that green stuff I like to make and put on my meat. And then we will have some um, Argentinian beef. All right, next one. France. France. Uh, hello. Oui, oui, monsieur. I'm so sorry I gave you herpes. Uh, I was smoking and I could not talk properly as I drank my wine and came on your teeth. Oui, oui, monsieur. Very good. How about Australia? Okay. All right, mate. Let me get these Aborigines out of here. Get my kangaroo. And I'll catch this crocky. And I'm gonna throw it in the back of my big truck. You're nailing it today. Keep going. Yeah. Germany. <laughs> Und, I'm from Germany. I like to be tied up and shit on. That is my thing. Cause I am from Germany. <laughs> kind of fading off there, but uh, yeah, yeah, it was yeah, good. Keep first, going. First three. Greenland. Greenland? <laughs> Hello, I am from Greenland. Very nice to have you in my country. Lot of people assume that Iceland has green stuff and Greenland has ice stuff, but it's not that way. I'm from Greenland. Would you like a piece of whale? Keep going. Russia. Uh, so, hello, I am Russian. Are you the machine? You are? Okay. I think my accent's falling apart back to France. <laughs> I think I'm going back to France. Nailing it. Nailing it. Korea. Korea? Korea? I'm not going to do that one. <laughs> <laughs> do it in it's, honor of no, Bobby. No, 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 oh, no. Hi, I'm Bobby. Uh, Bobby Lee. I take my shirt off. I have a small dick. All right. Good. Hey, man, man. This is a shit show. <laughs> it's so rude. What? It's so rude. What's the problem? Everything's a problem. The fucking the chairs, goddamn yeah. Rudy, your Hold staff. Put it up, put it up, put it up, put it up the mic. You know, I come in here, dude. I come in here, dude, right? S- speak and English. Fucking... Speak English. Go ahead. I... Oh, that's very funny. I come in, right, and I say hi to the the, 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 the larger guy that works here. Uh-huh. Oh, Which... the, I can do uh, whatever that, the guy. Bert? The yeah. The circle, uh-huh. right? And then I come in here, I say, hey, Nevad, right? Nevad. Right? To the guy, other guy, the Jew, right? So nice, even though I was 20 minutes late. So nice, right? 30 minutes late, right? What are you doing over there? That woman that in there, her name is Jules. She's she's my daughter, pretty much. They're trying to steal her food. That's <laughs> crazy. Hey, and guess what? What? Bert took one of her own crustables. Oh, shit. Let me talk to Jules. Okay. Dito yeah. Bobby. How are they? They're really kind. Hey, talk like a white person. <laughs> Good job. Hi. Yeah, Ron. Hi. Yeah. Roddy. Get out of Hi. there. Bobby. Hi. Hi, Bobby. <laughs> hey, Bobby. Really? Everything is good. Everything is good. <laughs> oh, my God. She's fucking funny. Yeah, she she's fucking tied up. Tied up. Tied up. <laughs> okay, bye, Tito Bobby. Hey. Hey, uh. Hey. Tito Bobby. Yeah. Hey, I got to tell you something. Hung up on him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was fun. Old Tito Bobby. Yeah. What were we just talking about? Guys with guns. JD. 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 So we go into JD's is the Jameson Comedy Tour. 
And uh, right. it's me, Steve Byrne, uh, Danny Bevins, and Billy Gardell. And and the second we roll in, I'm closing the show because I'm the loudest of the group. And so uh, JD says, I, that, I don't know that guy. He's not closing. Billy Gardell's closing. And Billy is the guy, for you guys that don't know, is the guy on Billy Gardell. He's on Mike and Molly. He's Mike. <laughs> not Molly. <laughs> and so uh, and so so he's like, he's like, yeah, don't, don't worry. Uh, Bert will... Bert will close the show. He says, no, I don't know who Bert is. You're closing the show. He fucking hated my guts until the very end of the night. Last week, I, someone said he was in the Outlaw Biker Gang. Right. JD's had a stroke, I think. Yeah, he died. Oh, he's, he's, oh, he's, no, dead. he's in bad shape. He's, he's in, in bad, bad shape. shape. Yeah, he's a good guy. I liked it. So we go out to the thing, and I said, so JD, you're an outlaw, huh? Which you don't say to a biker. And he goes, excuse me? I said, you're the biker gang. Outlaw? Like, I'm being such yeah. a fucking guy in a movie. Yeah, you're, you're in the biker gang, the outlaws. You're the and square was, guy. And he was like, uh, what do you know about the outlaws? I said, my dad represented them in Florida. I said, slowpoke and lefty? And JD goes, you're Al Chrysler's kid. What? I swear to you. I swear to you. And he goes, are you fucking kidding me? God damn it. We come in the office. You be that little kid. That's you? I said, yeah, in Tampa. There's a bunch of guys that were got arrested in Jacksonville. On this big case, my dad represented them. And my dad would talk about the, uh, the fucking biker gang. And I remember the names. Uh, Your Lefty dad knows Slowpoke. some unsavory shit about these guys, for and, sure. And, and this guy went, are you fuck-? And he started bringing motherfuckers over. I remember it was snowing because he had an Escalade. Do you remember that? And, and it was always clean as fuck. And he was like, come on over, come on over. He goes, this is, uh, he, his dad was a lawyer for the fucking outlaws. And I remember, I remember, and then all of a sudden, next week, I got an offer to do a weekend there. 1300 it was thirteen hundred for like fucking seven shows. I want to say. And you had to stay at that condo. I uh, know we stayed at a hotel. Oh, I, would, I didn't go back. I didn't go back. My god! I, I made a bet with the with the bar staff that on Sunday I'd make a hundred dollars for tips and everyone. I promised them, and I said if if I'm wrong, you guys all have to get naked on stage. But if I'm right, I'll get naked on stage and you can take a picture with me. And I was wrong. Uh, they didn't make hundred dollars. And JD naked? JD goes get, take your fucking clothes off. And I was like, well, uh, it was like a joke bet, JD. I was trying to raise their tips. And he was like, take your fucking clothes off. So I got, there's a picture of me naked on stage with everyone from uh, Joker. Hey, did you like um, my, recommend, my recommendation in and of itself? Ooh. On Hulu? Could not sit through it. Why not? <laughs> what was the point of it? <laughs> That's an interesting question. Um, what What do you think the point of it was? Uh I, I'm sh- I had to be had to have a really great secret ending where he was related to everyone. Secret and- ending. Or something had to have something because I, I was. I, mean, I don't mean to shit on it. I'm sure that guy yeah. is extremely talented. He is. He is. He's he a. Uh, but here's the other thing: is like I did a podcast with him. He I know. Did, I saw yeah, that, yeah. and then I was like, and you're like, I don't want to give away your show, and so I was like, okay, it's going to be a good show. And I started watching it with Leanne, and Leanne's such a cunt. Do you guys know the word cunt in in Philippines? Um. What is it? We can say pisti or putangina. Putanginga. Putanginga. Yeah. Putanginga. Putang ina. Putang ina. And that's the, the fucking Spicks did that. They came there and they <laughs> he give can you say puta. that he's, he's Spanish. <laughs> um, the, uh, I hope you don't think I'm apologizing for Spick. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm his friend. I can say it too. <laughs> puta. Leanne just goes, I don't get it. It's like five minutes in. Five so, minutes in? Yeah, so now I'm like, she's because it takes a little long because he's like, this is the cross. Yeah, cross, like, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so, and Leanne's like, I don't get it. Where, where is this going? Where is this going? And I'm like, hey, can you stop, please? Because I'm trying to enjoy it. And she's like, okay. Yeah, that's how to ruin it. Though. Yeah, and then she's like, it's slow. And I was like, babe, it's not slow. It's just he's building to something. Yeah. And then I'm rooting for him. I'm like, please yeah. do something fucking big. Oh, yeah. And then 45 minutes in, 47 minutes in, he still kind of hasn't done anything big. And I'm like, I mean, he brings... It was interesting when he's like, all right, can the person that was here at the last show stand up? Yeah, and then yeah. that person stands up. Yeah. You'll be here tomorrow. You don't know what's going on. They don't know what's going on. Yeah. It's like building to something. I'll watch the second half. It was just at 47 minutes I was sober, and I was like, it needs to speed up. Okay. Like, it, it, there's not a lot of action. And then I'm like, I'm definitely not watching Settle, Settle, Settle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, no. Well, because I'm like, I don't can't trust your fucking your your recommendation you should see the feedback on my recommendations right? no yes have you guys seen uh in and of itself yeah fancy <laughs> Be- did you like it i loved it how the fuck bro listen to me okay you saying that you didn't get it and tapped out is an endorsement of the show <laughs>